Hello. So a few hours ago, they launched the Guardians of the Island event. I've talked about this event a few times. This is a Skinstone and um, Outland Queen event. It's actually, if I said, one of the better ones. Because this is one of those, like, Skinstone's one of those things that pretty much all players need for, like, ever. Like, it's just, you can always use Skinstone's. Like, even if you don't spend a lot on this one, you can usually get some free Skinstone's. Um, so it's actually a pretty good event. I like seeing this one. Um, Guardians of the Island, the monsters of the island have joined forces with the hordes of the darkness to cast a shadow over the Dominion. Brave warriors, are you prepared to fight them in the sky and on the earth, in the deep dungeons and across our shared homeland? So you have, uh, log in every day. You have get souls of heroes. Like, so if you have, like, a bunch of Julius dolls from the Julius event, um, that we just finished, like, this might be a good time to open them because you will get a bunch of souls. You only need to collect 450. Um, reach VIP 5. If you're VIP 5, you'll get 5 of these skin crates plus some Allen coins which could be used to buy more skin crates. Um, Allen chest, 65 is actually not too hard to get to. Um, so most people can get these just by, like I said, doing their dailies. And then probably, like I said, so if you do all your dailies and then do the extras, like so, so you could do, then you'd only have to open two of 500s. Unless you have, like, spending your time, so you might be able to open um, a couple of extra um, for, on the cheap ones, like so, if you get a fourth day. Um, so these are, like I said, not too bad. Like, it's just like you can do this without spending a whole lot of emeralds uh, going forward. Spending emeralds. This one goes to 50,000 if you want all these extra skin crates and uh, Ellen coins. Like, um, Path of Power. So you have to do like a bunch of this. Stuff. So it's hard to do these ones without spending some emeralds on this one. I think you have to spend um, 63 quests. I think it's, you might have to spend all the way to like at least 20,000. It might even be 30,000. Um, to get all those, so that's kind of the only downside to this one is that you have to, to spend the this one with the path powers. Like you do have to spend some emeralds to get those ones, but if you're not spending a lot, you like I said, you still have the other stuff to spend energy. It's only twelve thousand for this one, which is honestly not too bad. This gives you the agility, intelligence skin stones. So, I mean, there's a way of like I said, if potentially if you have some resources. Like maybe you have some extra energy or you have some hero soul things like the Julius dolls or whatever. You can get some free skin stones without spending money. If you want to spend some money, you can get some extra um, boxes. Plus, you can get some extra skin stones here. Um, and I think they have some like bundle offers too for more uh, skin stones crates. So you can buy skin stone crates here. And these are actually not too bad. Like if you just want skin stones. Um, so each of these has 150. So... So that's 50, so 100 Kyrie crates is 15,000 skin stones plus another 30. So that's like um, 2,100 skin stones, if I mass right. It's, it's like 5 in the morning. Like we're just waiting, I'm just waiting for Guild War. So um, yeah, so it's double this and you give your guild mates some boxes too. Um, this only gives you three boxes for twice the price. You do get a bit more, but uh, this honestly a better value than this one just because uh, you could buy this one twice. You also get more Allen coins, so honestly, you could buy this one twice for the same price as this one, and it's just better. Um, four times. Okay. Do, do, do. This is where it actually starts to get. This is... Yeah, I don't know. I kind of think... That's actually not too bad. Let's do three times... Eh. Honestly, I kind of feel like this might be the best value just because of the, especially if you bought this one, you'd give more boxes to your guildmates. Remember, that's 29 times this gift, so you'd be giving that many more to your guildmates. It's a lot of extra skin stones. Um, like I said, but yeah, no, I mean, if you want to buy skin stones, like there's also a case we made just to buy emeralds during 4X and then using those emeralds to buy skin stones from the outland chest. Like you open outland chest and then you can just get skin stones that way. Like, and all the way to the... Right, generally, if you're buying, like I said, lots of... Stuff, for most most times, like, the most efficient way to get skin stones is to buy emeralds during 4X and then wait here to get them in uh, outland chests for, like, for this right here. 4,500 usually gets you, like, 30... 3,000-ish skin stones. I can't remember the exact numbers, like... But it gives you about 3,000 skin stones on average, assuming you use all these outland coins to buy skin crates from the outland shop. Which is what you should generally use your outland coins for is these large skin crates. Um, not too much more to say on that one though. Um, and uh, if you missed my video from uh, yesterday where I talked about uh, if Julius is actually good, you can find that below. Thanks for watching.